Harvey Wanda, I'm Mark Eisenthal with you on this Monday. Hope everybody had a great weekend. The weather yesterday, boy, that was tough. You watched the Patriots game, the rain and the wind. It was cold. Temperatures close to 40 degrees, but the Patriots pulled it out. It wasn't pretty. But the defense is amazing. Our offense just sucks. I mean, where is it? Where did it go? Hello? Hello? All right, kids, here we go. Let's do some weather, shall we? A nice Monday around these parts, but showers coming in here Wednesday afternoon. A cold, dry, windy Thursday for Thanksgiving Day. Could there be a weekend storm? Probably Saturday night and Sunday, some more rain the way it looks right now. But for today, partly sunny and nice. Temperatures mostly in the 40s. And then overnight, clear and chilly. 31 in the suburbs to about 38 in town. Here's your five-day forecast starting with tomorrow. No, Mark, not five-day. Break your habit of the five day. It's now seven days. <sighs> What's the matter with you? It's Mick Jagger says, old habits die hard. Okay, so tomorrow's partly sunny, nice 50. Wednesday, some early sun, then increasing clouds, showers before dark. Actually, probably by early afternoon, near 50. Thursday, for Turkey Day, variable clouds and sun, windy colder, near 40. So for the football games, bundle up. Friday, sun clouds, windy and cold, 38. Saturday, thickening clouds, 40. Could be raining by Saturday night. Rain on Sunday, cool, 43. And by a week from now, we're going to see much colder weather coming in. It'll be in the 30s by next Monday, teens at night. I think that's going to be the start of a change of a weather pattern. We'll be following all those elements for you. Till then, I'm Mark Rosenthal. Have a great Monday, everyone.